This is Wave News Midday. Thanks for joining us here for Wave News Midday. I'm Brian Schlonsky. Before we get to your news headlines, we do want to get you caught up on the forecast. Not a bad setup out there right now, but things will be changing in a hurry. We have meteorologist Tawana Andrew here watching mm -hmm. what's to come and uh, getting us all geared up for another uh, round of winter activity. Yeah, right now it's actually really nice outside looking in the Bardstown. I've been slowly but surely watching the snow melting now that we're seeing all of this sunshine across the area. So we're going to get to enjoy one day of beautiful weather before things really start to change. Your temperatures right now warming up considerably. Still ahead here on midday, expect passionate calls for voter rights reform on Capitol Hill today as the Senate begins debate on two contentious bills. We'll have the latest from Washington straight ahead. And we're going to continue to keep an eye on the alert day coming for tomorrow after sunny and warmer day today. I'll break down the threats that come along with the wintry weather tomorrow after the break. But first, here's a look at your Kentucky lottery jackpots, the Mega Millions, 347 million, and the Powerball is sitting at 62 million. The Kentucky lottery, over $4 billion in grants and scholarships. For more than seven decades, we've been your local news leaders. And now, almost 75 years after becoming your very first TV station, we're leading into the future. We're investing in the tools and technology to bring you what's happening right now. Innovating how you plan for your day. No matter where you're watching, whenever you see this logo, you know it's local. It's making a difference. It's looking to the future. You know it's Wave. This newscast is sponsored by Morgan & Morgan for ThePeople.com. This is Wave News Midday. Back with you now this midday, we are watching Washington as calls for national voter rights reform are expected today on Capitol Hill as the Senate begins debate on two contentious bills. But debate could be as far as it goes. Bree Jackson has the latest from Washington.